sponsored by Penn State York. It's the Beat at Five. Now, here's Joe. Hey guys, welcome back to Feed at Five with your hashtag of the day, tweets you may have missed, and the show that makes you think. I'm Jones. Let's feed. First up, Angry Birds tweets, You flockers have been crushing them levels in Angry Birds 2. Who's ready for new ones? First of all, them levels? Even the companies can't write things correctly. What do you think this is teaching the kids who can't write things correctly? Unbelievable. Second of all, slamming birds into things is still a thing. Windex should buy some advertising. Vanity Fair tweets, These senior citizens may know more about Vine than you do. Great, get ready for a barrage of six second bingo videos. And speaking of videos, Facebook's new Moments app automatically creates music videos from your photos. So now there'll be even more videos on your newsfeed. So Facebook will see you watching your friends' videos and put those same friends back in the feed, thus perpetuating the problem. Now what would be cool is if they actually could get real songs behind them. But alas, those pesky licensing fees. E! News tweets, Dave Franco and Alison Brie are engaged. You have to see the ring. Okay, so you purposely put a picture up of her left hand without the ring? I know you want people to click on your article. Talk about using the carrot to bait us in. Because we've all been there. Some of us more than others. Your hashtag of the day brought to you by Penn State York is locked out. Check it out. Forbes Tech has a guide for using Snapchat for small businesses. For advertising deals that are a very, very limited time. Everything must go, and when they're gone, they're gone, people. Unless you believe they're on Snapchat's server somewhere. CNBC tweets, Alibaba is using AI to take on Amazon and Microsoft. Eventually, you're gonna be able to snap a photo of what someone is wearing, and it will bring it up on your phone for you to buy. If you wanna dress like your friends. But mainly I chose this article because Alibaba is fun to say. Bet half of you just said it. Droid Phone News tweets, major technological advancement leads to 3D printer that could change the face of 3D printing. Yes, scientists yesterday hooked up a 3D printer to an AI unit to see what it would print if it could print anything it wanted. And what do you think it printed? Another 3D printer. Okay, not really, but that last article got me thinking and it would have made a way cooler story. All right, everyone, that's our show. Thanks for stopping on by. Until tomorrow, I'm Jones. Stay loud.